situations, but mainly with the young people in school. It may be um, that they've fallen out of friendships um, with, with young people in school. Um, that they may might be um, receiving nasty comments, that they might be having um, nasty looks. I was cyberbullied by this boy. I was scared coming into school. Like, scared he'd just find me and just start, like, bullying me face to face. I suffered year seven alone because I thought if he'd said, if anything happened, like I told anyone, I'd get bullied more and I'd basically get beat up and stuff if he ever found out I did. So I went to a pay listener in year eight and um, it was one of my good friends and I just told her the story and she said, it's serious that we need to sort it out. It is important that they look around and see who they have that they feel that they can talk to. And sometimes that might be a teacher, that might be a support staff member at school, it might be a friend or a friend's um, parent or something like that, or it could be somebody like me, a school nurse. I think it's really good to talk about it. Um, if you don't have anyone to share it with, you can end up feeling quite isolated, you might not want to come into school, you know, it can be quite a scary feeling for you. They can look online, there are lots of helplines, childline or, or things like that um, on the internet and most people are internet savvy nowadays, aren't they? I feel really happy that um, it's stopped and I'm actually a really good friend with him now and um, he's said, oh, we're really good friends, how could it happen? And we've just turned really good friends, we laugh about it, and basically he's regretful for what he's done.